Hello and how are you all today? My name is Priyanka and the question says lead pencil consists of a cylinder of wood with a solid cylinder of graphite filled in, in, the, in, in the interior. The diameter of the pencil is 7 millimeter and the diameter of the graphite is 1 millimeter. If the length of the pencil is 14 centimeter, find the volume of the wood and that of the graphite. Now, firstly, let us understand this question. Now, here, this is a wooden pencil having a cylindrical cylinder of graphite fill in the interior. We are given the diameter of the pencil. That means the outer diameter as 7 millimeter. So that means the radius that will be capital R will be equal to half of it. That means 3.5 millimeter. Also, diameter of the graphite, it is also in the shape of the cylinder inside it, that will be the inner diameter is given to us as 1 millimeter. Therefore, the radius that means small r will be equal to half of it. That means 0 0.5 millimeter. Also, we are given the length of the pencil as 14. That is the height of the cylinder as 14 centimeter. Since all the values are given to us in millimeter, let us convert it into millimeter. That means 140 millimeter. Now let us firstly find out the volume of the graphite. That will be equal to pi r square h. The value of pi is known to us as 22 by 7. r that is the small r is given to us as 0 0.5 so it will be 0 0.5 the whole square and h is 140 millimeter. So 110 millimeter cube. Now what else we need to find out? We need to find out we can convert it into centimeter cube also. So the answer of it in centimeter cube will be 0 0.11 centimeter cube. That is by dividing it by 1000. Now let us first find out the volume of the pencil also. Volume of pencil, that means the whole volume we need to find out will be pi r square h. Here we need to refer to the capital R. So it will be 22 by 7 into 3.5 the whole square. That is the capital R's value into h. That is 140. So here the answer of the calculation comes out to be 5390 millimeter cube or on converting it into centimeter cube also by dividing it by 1000 we have 5.39 centimeter cube. Now we can easily find out the volume of the wood. 
it will be equal to the volume of the pencil minus the volume of this graphite, right? So it is equal to volume of the pencil minus volume of the graphite that is further equal to 5.39 centimeter cube minus 0 0.11 centimeter cube that is further equal to 5.28 centimeter cube so the final answers to the session are first of all volume of wood is 5.28 cm cube and volume of graphite is equal to 0.11 cm cube right so this completes my session hope you understood the concept well and have a nice day